The setup of our hospitality unit uh, takes a lot of pre-planning and prep preparation. It takes a manpower of about six to eight hours to physically erect the structure. Uh, and not quite that long to tear down, but certainly still the same organization, uh, consistent packing and loading, all those things are important so that each time it's brought out, it's uh, able to be put up quickly. The biggest challenge for Indianapolis, uh, maintaining our hospitality structure, is just the sheer length of the number of days that we're here. Uh, it's, it's easier in a lot of ways because we're at our home base, we know what available food warehouses, but at the same point, we're here for 14, 15, 16 days. Well, we're really proud of our uh, mobile kitchen. It is basically a restaurant uh, commercial kitchen on wheels. Uh, we're able to crank out as many as probably about 900 meals uh, a race weekend. Uh, we have the capacity to seat over 165 individuals at the same time within our hospitality unit. The purpose of the hospitality unit is, is multifold, really. Our primary concern is having a, a great place for our soldiers and their families to come and relax a bit, enjoy what we have to offer as far as a race day schedule. But additionally, it's a good platform to use for uh, leaders in the community business people, bring them in, have them the opportunity to visit with soldiers, see their families, interact a bit so that they're able to realize uh, the importance of hiring a soldier and also be able to see some of the skills and uh, leadership abilities that these individuals have that would make them even more want to hire a soldier.